mentality is your reality. I believe that's what it says. And it's a perfect kind of parlay into this conversation on the fact that like, hey, everything's not gonna happen uh, perfectly. Everything's not gonna happen the way it's planned, but it's your mentality when stuff does go wrong that will ultimately determine uh, your success or failure. Anytime that you try to do something great, any time that you try to step outside of your comfort zone, make an impact, provide value, you can rest assured there will be obstacles and you can rest assured there will be struggles. You can rest assured there will be outside influences that come in and try to tear down what you are trying to build up. Adversity is imminent. Uh, the environment, the scenario will never be perfect. It will never be ideal. There will always be situations, obstacles uh, that will arise. And I think as an entrepreneur, as a business owner, as a salesperson, as just a human being, understanding that on the front end, that there will be obstacles, that there will be adversity, that there will be struggles, uh, will put you so far ahead of the competition because you're you're almost prepared and waiting for it. And when it arises, you're like, oh yeah, of course this happened because I'm trying to do something significant. Of course there's obstacles, of course there's adversity. But just like with anything in life, when obstacles arise, opportunities are created. Adversity is necessary. If you think about the process of growth, if you think about what it takes to become a better human being, to become a better business person, to become a better spouse, better father, better you name it, you have to go through some type of adversity in order to grow. And that's the purpose of it. Like that's the purpose of the pain in adversity is for you to grow into the person that's able to do the things on the other side of it. At the end of the day, when an obstacle arises, when struggles come, you cannot stop. You have to keep pushing forward. When you're trying to bring light into a dark world, there will be obstacles and there will be opportunities for you to say, ah, maybe we need to take a step back or say, hey, you know what? Maybe we don't need to go so far. I just see it as another opportunity to keep pushing even harder. People that are doing things that are insignificant, people that are just strolling through life, um, kind of letting life happen to them, they don't face these types of challenges. They don't face this type of opposition. It's the ones that are trying to do something great, the ones that are trying to make the world a better place. With that, guys, I just encourage you that when things happen, take a step back and take a look at the situation as a whole and realize that, hmm, that's interesting. Why is this happening? Chances are, it's probably because you're onto something good.